Hello guys and welcome to How to Tech. Today we are going to explore some of the amazing text to video softwares that are available in the market. While some of them are free, but most of them are either paid or they are not yet available to the public. So first we will try to explore the free ones so that you can go ahead and unleash your creativity and create amazing results. So the first shout out is for Deforum Stable Diffusion. Link I'll be giving in the description below. Please follow that. So all you have to do, and this is very easy as well, all you have to do is give in these parameters. Now do not get overwhelmed by these parameters. If you do not know, just whatever the default parameters are, you can give them. But the most important thing is this particular portion, which says animation prompt. And look, this particular amazing animation that you are seeing on your screen right now, it is very simple. The um, artist has given is, he has named this as a journey trending on art station that's it and automatically ai is creating all the frames and it's going to combine the frames and generate a particular video for you now fps stands for frames per second you can go ahead and change this from 15 20 30 and experiment zoom is the zoom percentage that you need similarly you have the angle uh, and the sampler now the sampler is something that is the hidden algorithm that generates this specific style okay and the max frame is the number of maximum frames that this particular animation is supposed to generate right so instead of going too much technical you can just experiment with the animation prompts okay over here and whatever you give as text automatically deforum stable diffusion will try to convert this to video now this is a sample video if you go to the site as i'll mention earlier i'll be giving the link as well in the description below so this is another example where untitled art by greg rutkowski so this is what it's going to give you right and these are all mind-blowing animations so you can go ahead and explore this deforum stable diffusion great now moving ahead to our next option which is stable diffusion now stable diffusion also will be giving you some good images but unfortunately there is a lack of consistency right now which most of the developers are finding in uh, stable diffusion because you know the when you change from one frame to the other there the consistency is not so much there so for example we are going to give a cat a dog and a horse so it's going to morph uh, from a cat to a dog and the dog changes to a horse as you are seeing on your screen but what this particular algorithm does is it refers to the previous frame and it tries to generate the current frame scheduler the algorithm is not able to find the perfect blend between these two uh, frames right which is why you're getting this sort of video <coughs> so obviously the transition is not very smooth so one more example over here here we are uh, going to give so blueberry spaghetti versus the strawberry spaghetti now remember very important thing this guidance scale right generally it varies between let's say 1 to 10 the higher number you'll be closer to 10 that means you are more closer to your previous image right and the lower down you are let's say you are giving a guidance scale of one or two that means you you are going to be far off from your previous image so in short if the guidance scale is low you will get a different image compared to the previous image while if the guidance image is on the higher range you will get a similar sort of image uh, as the input image so i hope this is pretty much clear and you can go ahead and experiment with stable diffusion as well i'll be giving the link to this in my description below so these were the two free options that you can go ahead and try apart from these two i'd also like to mention the deforum stable diffusion but this time using uh, collab dot research dot google dot com right so i'll be trying to make a separate video on this uh, deforum stable diffusion version 0 
because there are a lot of parameters if you see over here which needs to be set up first and then only you can have your animations so I wanted to keep this video pretty much short simple and uh, give you a lot of free options in the beginning apart from the free options there are other options which are not yet available for the public as you may know this is make a video from uh, meta now I am not a fan of the kind of images and the video that uh, make a video is generating right now for example this is a very uh, generic example that you might, might be finding um, in most of the videos a dog wearing a super hello hero outfit but if I truly give my honest opinion I do not think this is a great video output right so the syncing again is not that great uh, so for example uh, this is another example where let's say a robot dancing in Times Square right so this is also I mean this is pretty much rudimentary I do not think this is a great video as well so plus this is not right now available for the public so let's not discuss too much about make a video from meta we will go ahead to imagine as well because I had to uh, touch imagine because it's from Google now as you can see all these videos that is coming out of imagine you can see um, a sort of rudimentary style to them because it is not that great right so it, right now unfortunately I do not have an access to imagine uh, because right now Google is not allowing ordinary I think it's in the beta testing phase or it's only limited to uh, some developers and testers who are right now testing it so once it's available to the public we can go ahead and experiment on imagine as well but as of now both um, the imagine from Google and uh, video from meta both of these options are not available for the ordinary public so we will be moving ahead to another option which you guys can try in this particular space right it's called as Kyber and all you have to do is sign up with Kyber you'll be getting 50 points on the fly so let's see what happens uh, it will ask you to upload the initial file right so I'll just click on upload over here so I will say this particular image again I got this image from our community portal in mid journey I'll say continue to prompt I'll say mountain oceans rocks so I'll say mountain ocean rocks and iceberg right and in the style of I'll say I'll say cinematic right so let's see what kind of video does Kyber generate so I'll say yes generate okay so it is done so let me go ahead and try to make it full screen so what do you guys think of this I think this looks pretty amazing right unfortunately we are having the Kyber logo at the top so you need a pro account in order for the logo to be removed I think I'm pretty much happy with this so this will do right now guys the last option that I want to show you for text to video is this this is called runway ml and runway ml is is right now trending everywhere I think especially the runway ml gen 1 do not worry I'll be giving the uh, description I will be giving the link in the description again so you can go ahead and have a look but this particular runway ml's gen 1 will be a game changer right so remember I was talking about uh, that particular glitch or you know the smoothness not being there when you are going to transition from one frame to another using uh, let's say stable diffusion or deforms stable diffusion even we have seen imagine uh, and make a video from meta uh, all these were not giving us the consistency but this is where runway ml is going to exceed all this all these you know products that I mentioned earlier and this is what you're going to get so I'll be making a separate video on runway ml as well because right now what runway ml gives you is runway ml gen 1 so they are 
doing something known as stylization mode where you basically combine a video and this is going to be an input video or the source video and you give a driving image and it can, can this plus this the the source video will be combined with the driving image and this is going to be the output on the fly right so this is pretty amazing similarly you have got storyboards and this is the output right so using a few notebooks you are you are going to treat the notebooks as a skyscraper and ai will do that for you this is masking and the least impressive of all come uh, i mean converting an ordinary dog to a pole colored dog that's it uh, this is known as render where the untextured render uh, this particular guy is swimming on the bottom of your screen right and if using the input you can convert this to something like this and this is the customization mode where you actually take a training image and you train the image to behave like your source video as you are able to see right so i'll try to make a detailed video on runway ml because this is definitely going to be a game changer right whatever text to video softwares i have discussed so far and i have seen have experimented runway ml leads all of them it leaves all of, of its competitors behind and it is just amazing so once you get access um, right now everyone most of us are on the waiting list for runway ml so go ahead sign up for runway ml's gen 1 and if you're lucky enough to get the access get started or be on the waiting list soon they'll be giving access to rest of us as well where you can go ahead and create amazing images so guys hope you like this video and if you're liking my videos do not forget to subscribe to the channel if you have any comments related to text to video uh, softwares do let me know i'll try my best to answer them and till the next time we meet keep creating and happy ai bye bye